order to get to Ginger Mountain, we have to pass through Naewon. It's a kind of a popular place for people to come. <laughs> Today we are at uh, Gen Gensher Mountain, Gensher Slan, and uh, it's kind of kind of a remote place. It took a, quite a while to get here, so uh, let's look around, okay? Okay, let's go this way. Behind me, uh, landslides are very common in Taiwan. This is a very recent one, but you have to watch out for landslides all the time here, especially if it's after a rainy period, and that's after it's been raining and then it gets dry for a little while, then the landslides begin. After walking 35 minutes from where I parked the car, now we are at the uh, trail, which leads to uh, the giant tree park and a waterfall. This marker tells us we have climbed up 200 meters on the Bedalman Trail. Well, we came back after walking maybe 300 meters, and uh, then we looked at the map more carefully, and we see this would be a five to six hour hike uh, to make the round trip. So it's about three hours up to about, and then you end up about 1,500 meters. So you climb, uh, well, you climb 1,500 meters from this point, yeah, further up, and we're already up in the mountains, so I'm not quite sure what the elevation is here. Not today. Uh, this is a September 5th, I think. To Genshire Mountain. That's in Shinju County. That's about an hour's hour away from here. And uh, we already, it seems like uh, we can see the see fall coming. Let me show you on a map uh, uh, where this uh, place is that I went. So from my home, uh, it was about. It was about uh, an hour's drive, and I took the uh, freeway. No, I, I took the freeway to Guanxi, and uh, here's Guanxi Township right here. And then I uh, took the exit and drove to uh, 
uh, through Guanxi to Route 3. And then from Route 3, uh, I got, I went to Naewon, right here, which is on 120. And I followed 120 all the way to the, uh, to Jinshu. Another point I'd like to make is, uh, there's nobody there when we went there, and uh, so I just kind of missed it. It was a quiet place. So my sister-in-law and I went out for a walk, and uh, <clears throat> my wife and her mother stayed behind and hung out. And as they were hanging out, they saw a troop of monkeys, big pretty big monkeys, my wife said. So there's some wilderness there uh, in that area. and. Uh, Another thing were the cicadas. Uh, the cicadas were uh, pretty mournful and sad, so I guess that's a sign that <clears throat> we're coming towards the end of summer here. Okay, although it does stay hot sometimes in Taiwan, but it's way into November, so we'll see.